It's Jeffrey Howe for Black Gunners in Education here to do a review on three types of defensive ammo for my new favorite gun. <laughs> the Smith & Wesson Governor. The Smith & Wesson Governor. Now, for this particular firearm today, I'm going to be trying out three different types of defensive ammo. The first up is going to be the Hornady Critical Defense. Now, this particular ammo is a uh, 410 2 and a half. It's a 41 cal FTX slug followed by two 35 cal round balls with 300 feet pound of 750 feet per, uh, per second. Now, this is the first one that I'm gonna put up on the, on, the, on the chopping block. So let's go ahead without further ado and get on it too. I'm all loaded up and ready to go with the Hornady Critical Defense 410 shot shell. I've got three targets. Top, middle, and bottom. I'm gonna take a shot at each, and let's just see exactly how it performs and how it spreads with the slug and those uh, BBs. That's uh, those uh, BBs that's following. Shoot the top first. Now, the only thing I can assume is, on here, looks like either the slug went in through here and the BB followed, because these smalls looks, looks very similar. On this one, of course, we can tell the slug went through here and it looks like the BBs followed each other into here. And on this one, looks like about the same. The slug went in through here and the BBs followed into there. So, that's the first shots that I took with the Hornady Critical Defense. All right, next up is going to be the Federal Premium 410 2.5 buckshot with the four pellets, triple lock buck. So, Lego. See it right in the top one. See where the wide went through. Here with the four bucks right there. Here for the middle one, the four bucks right here. And for the bottom one. So has a pretty good spread for looks like only seven yards. So not bad. Not bad at all. Next up, we got the PDX Defender which is the uh, three-plated defense disc projectiles followed by 12-plated BBs. So let's see exactly how this one performs. Whoa, about to drop it, whoa. <laughs> Alright on this one, it shows that it looks like the three discs hit here, some of the BBs hit here, and then I saw like one or two hit down here onto this target when I shot this first target here. Right here. You go all the three discs looks, looks like they hit here, and some of the BBs spread out pretty good, and then I saw that one went down here as well. Then the bottom one, looks like all of them hit the actual target, the three discs. And I can't tell what other bees, I don't know if they all went in the same hole, don't quite look like it, but 
Well, looks like one went down right over here, possibly. So, so that's how we're looking at with the uh, PDX, um, the PDX uh, ammo by Winchester, PDX PDX one 410 ammo. So, huh? Interesting. So between the three, which one do you do you do you like, based off the patterns that you saw? I've got my personal opinion, and I have to be honest. Looks like I'm be going with the last one. And I actually like the way the last one did because it was direct with the actual three-plated uh, defense projectiles that went in there. And then it spread it, the rest of the BB spread it, which I kind of like. So it had it, it had it right on, and then the rest of them spread it. So I kind of like, like the uh, PD, PDX-1 um, 410 Defender. That's pretty good. But I will tell you, I am still partial to the Federal Premium uh, Triple Op Buck as well. So, but this one, I guess, will probably be more so my defense ammo because I really do like the way this one right here performs. What are your thoughts? Which one do you prefer out of all the three that you just saw? Let's talk about it, YouTube. Once again, it's Jeffrey Alpha BGOE, Black Gunners in Education. Just did a review on three types of defensive ammo for the Smith West Governor, which was the first one which was up was the Hornady Critical Defense. Then I did the Federal Premium Triple, triple Op Buck. And then utilize the PDX-1 410 uh, Defender. So, y'all have a beautiful day. See you out on the range. Here I'm about to do a mixture of all three rounds mixed into the, uh, into the uh, governor. Let's see how it operates.